Welcome guys, in this tutorial, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do lighting and rivet. This is the second electrical uh, tutorial that I'm going to create. The previous uh, tutorial was uh, with voltage 120, and now I'm going to create a tutorial with uh, voltage 220. And first, I'm going to work on power plan. Uh, and this uh, plan, I'm going to uh, select uh, my outlet and place it the outlet and also how to create the circuit and also how to select the panel board so let's start uh, from here to insert go to family us metric and then electrical from electrical mp and then electrical power and then terminal and from here, I'm going to select my uh, receptacle 220 volt. And then open. And now go to architecture and then place and component. When you select the receptacle, there is some sitting. Uh, there is uh, the elevation uh, 46 centimeter from the floor. So I'm not going to change this. And also from here, if you put your receptacle to the uh, the face you can change from here put on the face or work plan so i don't need to change because i put on the vertical face so let's start and put uh, the receptacle on the place i need one receptacle in here and also one i need in here i need one in here and also because there uh, there is the catching i need some more receptacle in here and also I need one in here for the TV and also inside the room I need one in here one in here one here and one in here and also I need one in this corridor okay and also I need one so as you know we need the uh, receptacle and the outside too so for the outside uh, we have to choose the uh, waterproof or gfi so now i'm going to select the gfi go to the system from here electrical and then uh, device and then select the electrical fixture and from here now i'm going to select the gfi duplex receptacle GFI this is uh, before you put this there is uh, the setting the elevation is uh, 1 meter and 20 centimeter so I'm going to put in 120 exact 120 so I need one receptacle in here one I need one in here need one receptacle in here and also I need one receptacle in here beside the mirror okay and now as you can see this is uh, the voltage of 220 so the my receptacle GFI is a, this is the with voltage 120 so select one of them and then go to edit from here change the voltage 220 and then apply ok and now this also automatically this change ok and now I'm going to select the my panel board so again go to component from here i'm going to select this uh, uh, 100 uh, with 100 min breaker because uh, i already know that my house is small and don't need too much power so i'm going to select this before you uh, place it there is some setting that this is the elevation uh, also uh, i'm not going to change this and also this the min uh, breaker 100 and also this is the uh, distribution that is uh, 
120 and 208 uh, volt. So this is the uh, the voltage between the uh, phase and uh, neutral, and this is the voltage between two uh, phase. I'm not going to change the setting, and I'm going to put my final board in here. Okay, and now I'm going to create the, the circuit and connect to the panel board. So when you click the the one of the receptacle and then go to the power, as you can see, it's still uh, there is not the panel board because the, my panel board is still not assigned. It means my receptacle is with the voltage of 220 and uh, my panel board is still with the voltage of 120 so how to fix this problem um, from here go to the system and then from electrical and then from here electrical seating and then from here uh, there is uh, some seating distribution system so in here now uh, I have this uh, panel board so now I'm going to change the voltage uh, in here. I'm going to change voltage between uh, phase to phase to 420 and voltage between uh, line and uh, neutral or ground to 220. And then, okay. And now I'm going to create my circuit and connect to the panel board. Select one of the receptacle and then from here uh, a dead circuit and uh, now I'm going to add some receptacle uh, I'm going to add this one this one and this one and this one if you did any mistake and uh, you can uh, select this remove from circuit and then select this now it's uh, removed from circuit so I'm going to add this as well this 5 to 1 circuit and then from here select your panel board this is uh, your panel board and then then finish and now continue as the same method select one of the receptacle and then go to power and then add a circuit to add circuit i'm going to add this one this one and this one and also this one to uh, one circuit and then from here already this is the panel board selected and finish okay because this receptacle are in the catching and i'm not going to add uh, uh, more than two so i'm just going to add two of them in one circuit click one of them and then power again add this circuit and then I'm going to add only two because uh, I need something put in here with uh, more power so I don't want to put more than two in one circuit again for the GFI or waterproof each of them have to be in one circuit select this and then add a circuit and this the panel already selected finish and then for this one as well I'm not at with this uh, guys uh, the other because this is the Maybe I use something with uh, high power, so I don't need to add other two. Okay, this is how to select receptacle and panel board and create circuit. So if you want to see, select one of them and then go to electrical and then see this is uh, this guy are uh, under one circuit connected to this panel board. Or if you click to the other one, click this one and then go to uh, electrical circuit and this show you which one is connected to each other.
and then if you want to know just click and go to electrical circuit and this is this is how to uh, select the receptacle uh, panel board and how to create the circuit and rivet and now i'm going to select the light so again from here go to insert and then family from here i'm going to select this one and this one and then open and let's go to architecture listen component and then i'm going to uh, select which one of them from here there is a different type so I'm going to select this fluorescent uh, 277 volt. Okay, this is the elevation. So uh, from here, I'm going to change. Uh, I'm going to put 350 because this this my ceiling is highest uh, 350. So and then okay. And now I'm going to put uh, on the face, not vertical. So select place on face then I'm going to put uh, 1 here 1 here and then 1 in here and 1 here also for the touching uh, one in the center, maybe in here, and one again in here, one here, like this. Uh, I already know the where is the place of the light, that's so that's why I directly put. If you don't know, you have to find. So because I work this already on AutoCAD too. Uh, so that's why I know the place of the light Okay, one in here And also I want to put uh, One in here the same light Okay, and now for the bathroom and for here. I'm going to put one different uh, Maybe this one and from here there is 60 watt to 177 volt and also 100 watt I'm going to use this 60 watt and of course for the elevation again I'm going to change 350 and apply and also from here I'm going to put on the face so I'm going to put one in here in the bathroom and one in here I didn't use uh, there is waterproof because I don't have uh, waterproof and my family that's why I use this this kind of light if you have waterproof light in your family you have to use uh, uh, waterproof and and the bathroom okay and now for the outside uh, for the outside and uh, uh, the top of the door and here and here I, I need also again go to insert family and then from here back and then external so from here i'm going to use uh, this one for the outside open then again go to component place and from here i'm going to find that Long. I have two kind 120 volt and 277 I'm going to use this one and select this one and from here as you can see there is the elevation and also I'm going to change to 3 meter apply and of course I'm going to put on vertical face so I'm going to put one the top of the door one in here and one in and here yeah this is how to select the uh, 
light and put the light and now i'm going to select the switch already i have in here and now i'm going to show you how to insert the switch go to system electrical and then device and from here uh, if you click the lighting switch lighting and then there is a different kind of uh, switch so i need single pole this one i put in the vertical and for the elevation i'm going to put one 25 okay and then i'm going to put one in here for this for light and one in here for this one and also uh, for this six uh, light one in here and also uh, one in here for this five lights okay I need a waterproof switch for this outside and also for the shower I, uh, from here go to family and from here back and then go to electrical and then MEP and then uh, electrical power and then the inside the terminal open terminal and then from here waterproof switch select this one and then open again go to architecture and place and component and there is uh, the electrical the waterproof uh, switch there is and now i'm going to put one waterproof switch uh, this is the elevation again i'm going to change this elevation to 130 because in the shower area and the wet area you have to put in the high uh, one in here for this and also one for this light maybe in here okay i forgot to put one switch for this yes i'm going to click this right click and then create similar and then I'm going to put a switch in here for this as well okay and now I'm going to uh, connect my light to the switch and also create a circuit for the light so as you know my panel board is with the voltage 220 volt and my light there is a different voltage 277 volt so uh, now I can connect uh, my light to the panel board as you can see in here uh, there is not show the panel board so how to fix this problem select the light and then go to edit type and from here change to the uh, to 220 and then apply ok and also uh, for this one also uh, because this is different type and then change to 220 apply okay and for the outside this light as well turn the voltage in here going to change to 220 then apply okay and now you can connect the light to the panel board so now I'm going to first create a circuit, select this one and then go to electrical and then uh, add a circuit and then add the light. I'm going to add all of them because I know this is not uh, too much power. I'm going to at all of them to one circuit and then from here I'm going to select the panel board and then finish if you now select this one of them and then go to electrical you can see this is all this connected and then connect to, connected to the panel board so now I'm going to uh, 
connect the light to the switch select again one of the light and then select the switch and then from here select a switch and then select this one yeah select this one of them and then switch and then the, in the system this one select this one this one and again from here select the switch and then finish and for this side as well select this one select switch and then adapt the system then select this one this one this one this one and then select switch and select this and finish and then for this as well select this one select switch and then edit switch stone and select this one and then select switch and then click this one and finish if you have one switch and one light it's easy select the light and then select switch and then select switch and just that's finish so again uh, for this if there is one no need to go to edit just click switch yeah like this and then again select this one select select switch like this uh, for this as well select switch Let's switch and this switch and this light as well. It's already uh, joined. It. Yeah. If you want to know which uh, uh, this light connected to which switch, just click this one and then from here switch system. They show you this this light this connected this switch. If you want to know the circuit, uh, go to electrical, select this, and now you can see this all light connected to the panel board. This are all one circuit. Okay, this is how to select the light and how to select the switch and also how to connect switch to the light. If you want to uh, wiring, you can also do wiring. So go to the system and from here electrical and then wiring there is uh, different kind of uh, uh, wire type uh, for example I'm going to select this I'm not going to do wiring in this uh, tutorial as easy it's not you can do wiring like this Okay, if you want to know uh, how uh, how many circuit do you have and which light and which receptacle belongs to which circuit, uh, right click in, the, in here and then go to browse and then system browsing. Uh, in here, uh, electrical, select electrical and then power beside the as you can see. This is if you want to know which circuit one belongs to which one see this uh, receptacle or circuit one circuit two this is from here this is circuit two and circuit this is circuit three this two and circuit four the circuit five is this one and circuit six is this one circuit seven is this one and circuit nine this one and circuit 9 this the all the light is this or the circuit 9 for example if you select this receptacle this see this is this one and this receptacle this in here and also if you select this in here okay and now let's see how looks like the panel schedule from here go to uh, and here there's a panel schedule and open this 
there is the circuit number and this the device that connected to the circuit and here uh, phase A, B, C, that's circuit 1 and circuit 2 connected to uh, phase A and circuit 3 and circuit 4 connected to phase B and also circuit 5 with circuit 6 connected to circuit C. This is automatically created by the rivet. So this is the total uh, total load then phase A and phase B and phase C and also in here show the show us the total uh, load uh, with this kind of device and exterior light and also for receptacle they have three kinds of uh, device that use in this project and also in here there is the total load and this the estimated uh, total load and also in here there is a demand factor that this is how created the panel board uh, with the rivet so if you leave uh, the area that used uh, the with the voltage 220 this is this tutorial is for you if you leave the place that uh, use the voltage 120 I have already created a tutorial with a voltage of 120 uh, you can find in my channel okay if you like tutorial like this please subscribe the channel and also like the video to get more tutorial like this so I think this is enough for this tutorial thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial